What's up guys, Tanner here with another Transfer Daily Update. Now today, it's a very tough one. It's very tough for me. Darlington Nagby, guys. Apparently Darlington Nagby would like to be traded to the Columbus crew, as reported by Dirty South Soccer, and multiple sources have confirmed this to indeed be the case. Those are not words that Atlanta United fans wanted to hear or really expected to hear this offseason. Now, it kind of makes sense why he would want that because his former college coach, Caleb Porter, is now the coach of the Columbus crew. The crew are staying, so there's going to be a lot of backing behind the team this year. I think the support's going to be at a really high level. And he's from there. He went to college at Akron. I think Lakewood, Ohio is where he grew up as his hometown. So he wants to go home. He wants to be closer to his family and play for a city that I probably imagine means a lot to him. Now it's gonna be really difficult for us because I think everyone really expected him to play a really large part in Frank DeBoer's system because he's so good on the ball. He's so technically gifted. His passing ability would really be highlighted in this system. So now we're facing the prospect of losing him. But if he is traded, I do have faith that the front office will get a pretty hefty sum, hopefully an international slot and some more TAM money. I think that would be rather useful for the five stripes. If he does leave, you know, I, I won't wish him any ill will. He was very important, I think, in our team last year, despite not having high numbers and goals and assists. I think we all noticed his absence when he was gone. Yeah, I mean, it'll be tough. It'll definitely be tough. But if he goes, I'll wish him well. I hope he does well with the crew. Not well enough that they can beat us or finish higher than us, but I hope that he does well there and that he's happy. That That's really it. That's, that's the answer to why he hasn't been playing in the preseason friendlies or why we haven't really seen or heard anything about him. Keep it tuned with Atlanta United Fan TV. We'll keep you updated as this saga goes along. I think we all thought we were done with sagas for this window, but apparently there's at least one more to come. I guess we'll just have to keep seeing how it goes. But living a, living the life of a Five Stripes fan isn't so bad when you're winning a championship. We got a new kit coming out. I feel pretty good about the season. Even if he goes, it would stink. But I got faith in the front office. I got faith in the players that we have. And if they bring someone else in, another international slot, I feel pretty good about it. I don't know. Maybe I'm being a bit bullish. Anyway, guys, that's it for me in this video. Like I said before, keep it tuned to Atlanta United Fan TV for all your news and your updates for everything. Hit a like, a subscribe. We really appreciate all the support. I'll catch you in the next one.